question. Where do you expect the Black Panthers? Well, I expect them to go out of the group stages, and I think that's it. Just knockout, knockout, knockout stage. Maybe quarterfinals, if we are lucky, but knockout stages. Just go out of the group stages, then knockout stages. That's what I expect. Uh, if we go out of the group, at what point will you see that now this team yeah, we have to? Oh, if they if, if they if they go past the quarterfinals, then I know ah, they, they can win it. If they just go past the quarterfinals, I'm telling you they can win it. The best of squad, your realistic expectations. Where do we get when you say that for this one, the team will start? Well, for this team, a quarterfinal appearance will mean they have overdone their expectations. The target should be a quarterfinal. That's what Ivan Grant said in 2015. The team was at its lowest ebb. He came in and said, they are just going to do well. We ended up in the final. But for, um, I mean, bad luck, we could have won that tournament. So I think a quarterfinal target should be fine. Because we've exited at around 16. We've exited at the group stages. That's the lowest we can get. So if we get to the quarterfinals, we have to, like you said, realistically, a quarterfinal target. But also, it's possible to win. Well, if you are to ask of my expectation, um, I, I'm actually expecting less from the Black Stars because um, looking at the last two African editions, we've not been performing very well. So, and this team, um, as Adek Adams asked, a, a coach who is going to the tournament for the very first time and things pertaining or things going around, Thomas Partey has not been included. We have um, Mohamed Kudus. He said he has a slight injury, but he's able to fit into this. But I don't think um, we, we are going to get up there because we check the group A. Even if we are to qualify, we would um, some or some will meet um, either the host nation, Ivory Coast or Nigeria, which is going to be a very tough game for us. So I think um, qualifying out of the group stage is, is my expectation. is enough for me. So you expect us to just qualify? Yeah, we, we should just qualify. And then the, the Jama from Ivory Coast will come to Accra. <laughs> When you ask me about how we are going to fare in this particular competition, I'm probably going for a quarter-final bet for the senior national team, the Black Stars. Our two um, previous selections that we played in the Afghan, I mean, it was just weaknesses. We were able to advance past the group stages. But hopefully, I mean, with the technical brains of Coach Chris Hutton and some of his technical handlers, and I'm hoping that we make the quarter-final So, that's about it. Semi-final will be a great achievement. We shouldn't go there to expect to end a 40-year drought. What's your prediction for this side? Ah, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell. It's hard to tell, honestly. Um, the Ghana national team have been backsliding as far as the Afghan is concerned, tournament by tournament. I don't want to be a pessimist, but if you've seen the last couple of competitions and how they've ended, you can draw your own conclusions. I will not say it for you. I just think that we 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 are better than what we show generally that's how i feel I, I i am one of those people who reject the argument that we don't have good enough players to compete or to win an afghan where our players are as good as anybody on the continent we just need to find a way to bring it all together and so if we bring it all together i think we could probably be one of those surprise packages this tournament if we continue behaving like how we've been behaving in recent tournaments i think that like i said we all know what's going to happen Thank you.